Hello again and welcome back uh, to my channel. Before in part one, I showed you from Simbrief how you create the flight plan and how you gonna save it uh, in the root folder to B3D or FSX. Now is the question: How I upload the flight plan to my GPS? And yeah, let's get started and I will show you how to do this. This is my beautiful uh, Pilatus PC-12. I love this plane. It's amazing, nice to fly. Uh, incredible uh, realistic flight di di dynamics as well. Here we have the GPS. The first you will do is click flight plan. Then you press menu, select catalog, and again menu. These um, flights you probably don't see because I saved this uh, earlier today. And you select import. Here is uh, the flight, flight plans I have in my folder in the root P3D and the uh, GT1 uh, uh, folder from flight 1. I think it's the flight 1 GTN, it's called the uh, folder. It's very easy to find. And uh, inside this uh, folder you find PLN and then you store all the flight plans you want to have. It's a very important you uh, save it in GFP format. Uh, that is the perfect with the sim, uh, SimBrief because you just select the GTN and it's done. You have everything what you need. You don't need to mess up your brain about how to create a GFP flight plan. So I'm looking for Echo Sierra Kilo Sierra and from there I will fly to Hamar uh, Echo November Hotel Alpha. So here it is. I just saved this for a little bit ago. I'm gonna fly from uh, to arrival airport what I showed you in uh, the last video to Echo November Hotel Alpha. Just select flight. When it's here you see the flight plan route I have. Here is something very wrong. Let me take a look. This can sometimes happen. The another uh, Yamna intersection here. That is um, actually very, very far away. So what we just do is click store. When I have it here, yeah, go back. And when you have it here, you just click here and activate. Okay. So this will be then the flight plan. But this waypoint is fucked up. So then I delete it like this. And voila, everything is solved. Then I fly direct to Hamar. And after Hamar we are, I uh, make a circle to see an announcing on Unicorn. And uh, look at the airport visual that there is no another traffic going on or dogs, children, whatever, so can be on the runway. So you go back. Open the map, and here you see the airport. There is Inrex, for example. If I want to use this intersection in the flight plan, it's also very simple. You go back to uh, flight plan 
and insert before in Rex in Rex Norway enter then uh, he changed direct to Inrex and uh, from Inrex he go to Homer. This is how you can insert waypoints like you want to have. There you see the Inrex shows up as a waypoint. It's in the Swedish borderline to Norway. And from there into Homer. This is how you're gonna do it. And if your flight plan contains jetways, it's no problem. As long as you save the route, the jetways and all uh, waypoints comes up. This is the simplest and easiest way how to create the flight plan. So I hope my explanation work. Um, I apologize for my English is not probably the best. Uh, I'm a from Norway, so um, I'm used to speak a lot of different uh, languages, but uh, English is not the best one. Anyway, I wish you guys a nice day and uh, stay safe, especially in these corona times.